Okay, y'all, welcome back. PR here again. You know, I, I'm going to finish this day out what I started the other week, uh, and I get some riding in. So I, I sit behind a steering wheel and show y'all my graph. And again, I don't have nothing but straight down 2D sonar. So there's no, no fancy stuff, no side imaging, um, none of that. And I'll just show you how I do it and how what I look for, you know. Um, and I even come up across one of these uh, where the state or the county puts out brush or structure and it's got a, a buoy on it that says fish and so you'll see me catching fish on it too but mainly i wanted to show you the graphing and man i sit on two brush piles one especially i sit on one brush pile and it's just thick thick with fish mostly small fish and again it was a shallower brush pile too 11 10 11 foot of water check those out uh again you know sunline little albu garcia set up i put the old old reel back on here uh, that other one, that little Mr. Crappy reel I had, just uh, I just wore it out way faster than what I thought I was going to. Um, and I just went back with this one. Again, this one don't have a clicker on it. The little clicker uh, kind of, I think it just broke off. There's a little piece of metal inside there. So there's no, no drag to it. I mean, no sound. I mean, there's still drag there. But Again, custom magic jigs. Uh, using a pearl, you'll see me throw this pearl to Silver Flake. Well, I got them both laid out here. And then I also, I start off throwing a little cracked green, the green color. The little split tails. He's, you know, there, there's some great stuff. custom magic jigs. Y'all check Chaw. Text Chaw. Text Chaw. I'll leave his number in there so you can text him real quick. Um, my line breaks a couple times in in this video. I'm not scared to show that. You know, this is five pound test, and it's just not made to hold up through all I, the the stuff I put it through. To, and you'll see me get hung up, and I kind of work the jig out of the brush. I yank fish out of that brush, so um, it it, it takes a whooping, and uh, it just so happens I, I, I break it, and both times. The, the, when the line breaks out the fish are in the boat uh, and it was right there at the front of it right there where it gets all the damage you know and you can feel it there still i need to retie now pictures though uh mr philip mr philip uh perkins i got him in here with two beautiful bass one a little over six pounds like 6.3 pounds one on a frog uh, i also have his son in here mr ryan and uh, his daughter hayden hayden with some, a bunch of a mess of crappy too. I think they caught them up at Bugs Island or Kerr Lake. Uh, we call it Bugs Island around here. Um, and you know that's it. You know, and, and then my, I got my next show. I got one for you. You know, we, we talked to uh, Mr. Larry about the brush pile. After I cut the camera off, I sit down and talk to him. You know, a little bit what he does and stuff. Y'all got to see that. So wait for that to come because we go out and build a brush pile. You're gonna love it. Check it out. But anyway, check this out. Thank y'all. So, just cruising. I think I found one. You see the marker up there? I went over it. It's, it's, it comes up real quick right here. It'd be a perfect place for a brush pile. See there, some right there. See that? Just on the corner where it's, it's coming up real quick. nothing on the marker itself almost all, all the way up to eight foot of water 
or some brush or something up here in seven foot of water, but it's way too shallow. That'd be a good old spot for a bass to lay. On the other side, there's the marker right over there. So I fell off of it. I'll watch it come back up when I get over here on top of it. see it's right in front of the trolling motor. It's just fish. It's, it is some brush or something on it, so let's look. Oh my 
my line broke again. I don't fish too much brush today. Got my line all shaky. Goofy. I got enough of sulfur. I got seven or eight. We'll let that one go. Now we got to retie. All right, retie and ready. There's the mark. There's the mark. That brush pile's loaded with fish. This one's small. Most of them have been small. Oh god. Boy, that one go. Another one. Another little dude, they just stacked in there, boy. Found a brush pile just stacked with them. They turn up my jig. Let him go. All right, so get rid of the green. Let's go to this pearl with a silver flake. Straight to it. Water, he come and got it. Little baby. Alright, so I had the little reel crap on me. Pick up another little reel, fill it up with some sunline. Get back on this brush pot. Stay in there. This old reel I'm throwing. I don't have no drag on. I mean, this drag there, it's just ain't got the sound. My pinion broke, I guess. Oh, little guy here had me in the brush. He come out, uh, got the jig just engulfed. Look at that. Gone. Heard a fish, let him go. There's a little bad one. Oh, he about the same size. He can go up the jig too. Well, I'm going to sit here and catch as many as I can. I probably caught a little 40 over off that little brush pile. All right, y'all, look. Man, I have fished seven or eight, ten brush piles. Two was really loaded up, but one of them, they would just eat up with the small ones. Man, I had a blast today. A little after three, the sun's really starting to come out good. I'm headed to the house. I got enough for supper. A couple of them kicked the bucket. Well, we got some slabs in there to eat, so. All right, what'd you think? You know, what'd you think? Again, five pound test, Sunline, Sniper, uh, FC Sniper, and then the Charles Custom Magic Jigs. 16th ounce jig head and the little split tail grubs. Hope y'all enjoyed it. Remember, like and subscribe, hit that like button. Also, the little notification bell, hit that notification bell. That way, every time I put a show out there, it'll, it'll hit your phone or your tablet 
your iPad or whatever saying I just released a new video. Can't thank y'all enough. I'm right on 4,000 subscribers. You know, that's pretty incredible. I just never thought it'd come to what it has. You know, I just started out just just trying to help some folks or, or you know, just pushing folks in the right direction as far as getting on some crappy down there. Thank y'all. Until next. Crash.